Morning. Um, there's a bit of footage, but it's rubbish. <laughs> it's just about um, what's going on. Not much. My Crohn's is really bad right now, so I um, got round to brewing a thing. The plan was to brew a Belgian triple, and uh, that didn't happen. Um, so that's now moved on to next weekend, and um, yeah, that's about it. That really is about it. Um, I think we have to reschedule the Belgium trip because most of my mates have pulled out. I, I don't know. They don't control their wives. Um, <clears throat> mine's happy to get rid of me. Uh, yeah, well, that's it. I've got nothing else. Um, I'm far from 100%. This is upside down, isn't it? <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, it doesn't matter. I think we're done. I think we're done. I think we're done. I think we're done. We're probably done. Anyway, I'll try and get some kind of update out later in the week, but this is all i got. Oh, congratulations to the SJ Paul winner. I don't even know it was, but he was from Britain. I don't even remember the beer. And um, so I'm presuming it was, well, it wasn't the one I thought was the best beer, but I presume it was that um, dark, stouty, portery, um, oats and... Um, black breeze, maybe black currant. I think it might have been that beer, um, but I don't know. I was trying to check my notes, but my notes seem to have all gone. Um, I never saw a video from this guy, so I don't even know which one it was. Um, yeah, um, I think I do think in the SJ poor because we are kind of it's a YouTube thing. I do think that people should do video reviews of the beers and um, that all came up a bit short didn't it. But I go in next year's and uh, if it's basically a straight let's brew the best beer we can brew um, yeah probably best chance to win this thing is to use do a dark beer because this competition took forever to get done. That's about it really. I'm uh, free hand in this one. Because they dropped it. <laughs> and that's it. I got it. I'm going to whinge otherwise, which I do whinge a lot. Um, well, oh, we're subscribed to Louisiana Beer Reviews. I mean, I don't know. Uh, he, 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 he's been there for years, but I've never subscribed to him. Um, he does some interesting stuff. Um, uh, yeah, um, that's about it, really. I'm going, okay, definitely going. Ciders, um, where are we? That needs to be like that. So, uh, cherry and apple. Uh, this is fruit. This is fruit. That's a conglomerate. It's very strong. Uh, this is going to be a big ass nasty drink that only my son would want. Um, apple cider straight, I believe. Apple and pear. Cherry and apple. I made that with K.A. No. Uh, <laughs> um, that's not. That's Umbongo. That's Umbongo. That's apple and pear. Cherry and apple. Uh, this is fruit. So there's all kind of things in that. It's a little bit fruity, but it's just a incredibly strong... Um, uh, I wouldn't want to drink it kind of thing. What else have I got? On the go. I haven't got a lot else. I've just bottled. 
that, that is the last saison. The last, it's like a film, the last saison. Uh, which will probably be what I call it. Or, I don't know, but that's just a little um, <laughs> jug and I had like leftovers and I was like, get in there. It's turned out quite clean. Uh, still got some pressure in, so that's all right. So it was a little cider jug uh, someone gave me and so I bunged a bung in it, bung in it. And uh, yeah, so pretty small batch. Um, we'll see where they go. This kind of really filled out quite nicely. Um, is that it? Down there. That's the black saison. That's the swine flu. That's swine flu. Look. Swine flu. Holmenen, Slachie, Sars, Mandarina, Bavarian. Um, swine flu saison. That is swine flu. That, that thing there. Anyway. Um, so that's that. Uh, there is the missing saison. So I'm going to do a label for that. That's the missing saison. Well, other than that, I've got saisons now out in the cool house. In there are the beers people have sent me that I've still to try. And I apologise that I haven't tried your beers. I have another box of these out in the outhouse. Down in that box there is my entry to go off to Wales. I just need the address. Someone sent me the address where I got to send uh, that that uh, uh, smash entry off because I don't know and I've left a message but I can't get nothing back so that may not be going anywhere the way I am feeling. Um, in this box, oh yeah, I'm not even sure what's in this box anymore. This is it. This is my smash beer. Whole melon, Bohemian Pilsner malt, and USO5 yeast. Um, that's bang on carved up. Not much crap in the bottom, which is good to see. A bit boring. Um, that's all you're getting though. I think another week for these, at least another week, maybe longer for that. It's just a nasty thing. Um, that's ready for bottling and I'll do that and then next week I'm doing a Belgium triple uh, which I'm going to try and film but we'll see okay uh, other than that what else is there oh the smart brew water testing uh, yet to use it uh, need to do that no don't think I've got anything else um, oh yeah, um, boxed and ready to ship. Uh, I have got a box and ready to ship of four beers. They're at my office already. Um, paperwork is a nightmare to send beers to the States. What is going on with that? Need to sort that out. I'll do that this week. So, one of, uh, one of three people is destined to get some beer in the next week or so. Um, I need to do some beer tastings as well. <laughs> I am so, so behind on everything. Um, never mind. We'll get there in the end. Uh, yep, okay. Talk to you all soon. Um, maybe later this week. Okay. <laughs>